Medical Center of Aurora ER. This is Ellen. Go ahead. Good afternoon, Aurora South. This is Paramedic Salazar uh, with Medic 104. We are en route to your facility routine with a 67, 6, 7 year old male. He's a chief complaint with sudden onset of left sided facial droop, slurred speech, and left sided weakness. Vital signs are as follows. He has a blood pressure of 190 over 110, pulse of 66, normal sinus on the monitor, no ST changes, no XP, respiratory rate of 16. We're working on IV axis and have him on oxygen by non breather at 15 liters. This will be a uh, pre hospital stroke alert. Any questions? Okay, no questions at this time. We'll see you in five to six. Medical Center for Clear. Okay, thanks very much. 104 Clear. Can please page Dr. Scott and call a stroke alert for room one, please? When it comes to strokes, the Medical Center of Aurora knows that time is brain. In addition to being a primary stroke center, we now offer the latest in stroke technology, Remote Presence Robotics. The InTouch Health Remote Presence Telemedicine Technology is an advanced computer system that allows a neurologist off-site to immediately assess and direct treatment for a stroke patient. He has a uh, 18 gauge in his left AC. Uh, bloods are taped to the bag. Uh, no known al uh, drug allergies. Any questions for us? Let's go ahead and get him on over. What are you feeling right now? Have any pain anywhere? No. no? Okay. We have Dr. Wagner here. And he's going to be talking and ask you some questions. Okay, sir. Um, is it true that you were last, you, you were normal about two hours ago? With live two-way audio, video conferencing features, and camera capabilities, as well as access to remote medical devices, a neurologist can conduct a detailed evaluation of the stroke patient, even though he is not in the room with the patient. This thorough evaluation, before the on-call neurologist even arrives, affords opportunities for quicker, more effective administration of TPA. The quicker the treatment, the greater the chances of restoring blood flow and saving brain tissue. Hello, sir. I'm John Scott. I'm one of the neurologists here on staff. Hi, Chuck. Nice to meet you, sir. Dr. Wagner, nice to see you again. Hi, Dr. Scott. Let me give you an update on what I know. Above all else, we are dedicated to the care and improvement of human life. For excellence in stroke care, you can count on the Medical Center of Aurora. TPA is a medication that has really changed the way we treat strokes. Uh, the majority of strokes are caused by lack of blood flow to the brain. We call those ischemic strokes. Uh, TPA is a medication that breaks up blood clots uh, most often, strokes are caused by a blood clot in one of the arteries that's preventing blood flow to the brain. TPA works by breaking up that blood clot, blood clot and hopefully restoring blood flow to that part of the brain. Well, the golden hour is a term that we often use uh, here in the emergency department. It, it uh, indicates that from the time a patient arrives through the door to the time they are treated with TPA, we like that to be in less than an hour. Uh, to uh, properly evaluate a patient, there are certain things that we need to do to determine whether or not they've had a stroke and whether or not they're a candidate for TPA. <clears throat> it's very imperative that we do that within one hour time frame. And uh, that's why we've implemented the telemedicine program throughout all of uh, the Health One hospitals in the Metro Denver area uh, to make sure that all of the patients, all of the hospitals uh, can, uh, uh, can fulfill that criteria of treating patients with TPA within one hour. When the EMS community brings a, a suspected stroke patient to a hospital, they want to ensure that that patient gets the best care. Through telemedicine, we're able to um, utilize our stroke experts in all of our hospitals throughout the, throughout the Metro Denver region and ensure that those patients get the highest level of care anywhere in Denver. <laughs> 